Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of my channel. Right now I am at Frankfurt Airport in Germany and I'm about to take my flight to Barbados. But that's not my final destination. I'm going in the end to Union Island. It's a very tiny island in the middle of the Caribbean and it's amazing there, it's super beautiful. It's gonna be my second time there. It's one of my favorite places to go. So that's it. I see you guys in the other side of the ocean. Let's get in there. So we just arrived here in Barbados, getting our connection to Union Island. And it's pretty nice because you just get out of your plane and then they wait you here. So you go straight into the plane where it's very small to go to Union Island. They personally, they're gonna grab our bags and put in the other flight and wait to get out of this travel pants and put my board shorts on. We arrived here at Union Island. Woo. Finally, our first day out of the room. We're gonna go kiting. You, pretty excited. It's very, very windy. It's blowing like 25 knots. Isabel is also excited to go kiting. We just arrived here at Jeremy's Pro Center, and as you can see, it's very windy. Bumpy, nobody out there, so I can't wait to go to the water. Just gonna pump my car really quick and jump in because it was not easy to be inside of the room for five days. You look good.
Union Island right now. I am with Jeremy Tronet. Welcome to Union Island, Reno. It's Thank great you. having you here. I'm, I'm stoked. Nice. Great wind, great weather. Union Island is a little paradise. You know, it's like this little island in the Caribbean. You don't have big resorts here. It's small. Uh, there's not space for too many people. So we like to keep it a secret. So basically, if you are flying to the Grenadines, if you want to come to Union Island, you want to kite off the Grenadines, you want to fly to Barbados, which is the island right next to, to us. And then from Barbados, you fly direct to Union Island. What you want to do is book online to Barbados, then go to our website to book the, the little flight. Now for the wind, November to end of July, that's our windy season. We have between 15 to 25 knots. The easiest is to go on our website. It's uh, jtprocenter.com. Once you go on the website, it has all the information on how to get here, all the information regarding the accommodation, the wind season and everything. If you want to come here with no kite gear, he has all of the newest gear from Duoton, all of the new kites, all of the new boards, harness, bars, everything, subs. So you can pay a fee of 150 US dollars per day and you have access to anything you want to have to enjoy your time in the water. So you can come with only your hang luggage. That's perfect, super comfortable. It's really worth it to come here to also learn how to kite and to improve your kiteboarding level.